What's up guys, Dan here with Bitter Tech, and today we're taking a look at the Spigen card holder. Just like it sounds, it's a MagSafe wallet, but unlike the Apple wallet, which I have right here, it also offers a MagSafe stand attached to it, complete with multiple viewing angles. Now, before we get into it, if you're looking for more MagSafe accessories, check out my MagSafe playlist, which showcases some of the top MagSafe accessories from the Belkin MagSafe car mount to the ESR halo lock to the Anchor Power Wave. Whatever you're looking for, I've probably got a video on it, so check that out. And if I don't already have a video on it, I'm probably getting to it, so be sure to hit subscribe to see more videos like this from me. Now, let's get into it. So get ready for the world's fastest and tiniest unboxing. So in the box, we're getting the card holder itself. And then as well, this card that shows you where the magnets are, where the metal plate is, and then all of the different ways that you can mount this device. You can tell already that it's made of a really great carbon fiber-like material. It's got the Spigen logo on it. On the back, we've got the easy grip for taking your cards out. And we've got the tri-fold here for the stand. Opening it up, you can put your cards in that slot there, and then this just becomes the stand. I'm really impressed by the quality of this. It seems a lot nicer and almost feels more premium than the Apple version of the card holder. We can see comparing the two here. We've got the one Apple version, and then you have the carbon fiber like material of this one, which is a lot more premium. And taking a look at the size comparison here, you can see they're actually pretty close together. If anything, the Spigen one might be a little bit thinner so this is said to fit any of the iPhone 12 series. Here we've got just the iPhone 12. You can see just magnets right on there. And it fits pretty snug. It seems quite secure. And you can put it in this orientation or you can rotate it to go sideways like that. And it all just depends on how you want to mount this device. And for mounting, you have two different options here. So you can fold this back like that, and it's gonna become just a standard mount. Or you can do it a little bit shorter by flipping it around that way, and then it goes a little further back. Either way, it's actually quite a helpful device to have, allowing you to prop your phone up anywhere, and it's stable enough that it feels like great quality. Now, the biggest scrutiny of MagSafe wallets is actually the security of it. After all, losing your wallet is already easy enough and who wants their wallet to accidentally come off when say, sliding the phone into their pocket? And for the Spigen card holder, there's still the same concern here. So I'll say that the magnets are strong enough that it stays on all day without me having to worry. And while I found myself easily sliding it into my pocket, I was being overly cautious to not let my pants hit the wallet as it was going in. So you are still gonna make that conscious effort to not disturb it as you're putting it in your pocket. But still, even if you are concerned about the card holder aspect of this and losing the cards that you're putting in this, using it primarily as a stand is still a pretty good option to have. With a width that's about the same as the Apple wallet, and that added functionality of the stand, it's a great option. Now, the only thing to consider is that if you have this wallet mounted, you won't be able to mount your phone to other devices like a MagSafe desk stand or a car mount. If you wanna use any of those accessories, you'll have to remove the wallet and then put it back on after. This alone stops me from using this or even the Apple wallet on a regular basis. But let me know what you guys think about the Spigen card holder. Is this something that you're interested in? Would you use it or are you just as concerned as you were about the Apple wallet? If you are interested in picking it up, I'll leave a link in the description below for you. 
As always, remember to hit that like button because it tells YouTube that videos like this don't suck. And again, if you are interested in more MagSafe accessories, check out my MagSafe playlist live on the channel now and consider subscribing to see more videos like this from me as there are more on the way. Thank you guys for watching and supporting the channel and I'll see you in the next one.